Happy Friday, preschool. All right, let's get started today. So, let's find out what number comes next. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. 22 has two twos. How fun. So let's put it right there and let's go all the way up and see what day it is. What is it? It is Friday. Let's work on our weekdays. Here we go. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Great. What month is it? Do you remember? May. What letter does May start with? M and then A and Y. So M, A, Y. May. Good job, everybody. All right. So let's work on a few of our numbers. So I remember, I want you to do one to 10 and draw your numbers in the air again for me with your finger. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job, everybody. You're doing really good with that. Now, you're more than welcome to replay the video very slowly and write those letters with either a crayon or a marker or a pencil and practice writing those instead of just doing them in the air. That would be really good. All right, let's call back Billy the Duck because what rhyming song are we gonna do? Do you guys remember? We are doing the five little peas, yay! Okay, here we go. Five little peas sitting in a row. Five little peas said, go, go, go. They rolled and rolled so far, 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 and rolled right into my pea pod jar. Yum. So what are our rhyming words? Row, go, and far, jar. Great job, everybody. All right. So let's practice our uppercase letters. We're gonna say them and then make their sounds, okay? Ready? A, ah, ah, ah. B, ba, ba. Ba. C, ka, ka, ka. D, da, da, da. E, eh, eh, eh. F, G, ga, ga, ga. H, ha, ha, ha. I, 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 i. J, ja, ja, ja. K, ka, ka, ka. L, u, M, m, N, Mm. O, ah, ah, ah. P, pa, pa, pa. Q, qua, qua, qua. R, er. S, T, ta, ta, ta. U, ah, ah, ah. V, uh. W, wa, wa, wa. X, Y, yak, yak, yak. And Z. Z. Great job. When we do that, it sounds like we're bumblebees, doesn't it? How fun. Okay, so today we're still working on plants in our garden. So let's read a book. This one is How Does Your Garden Grow by David Turkin. So let's see, how does our garden grow? Soil helps my garden grow. The plants in my garden have roots that grow in the soil. Plants need soil to grow. Water helps my garden grow. The plants in my garden take in the water through their roots. Plants need water to grow. Sunlight helps my garden grow. The plants in my garden use sunlight to make their own food. Plants need sunlight to grow. Soil, water, and sunlight make my garden grow, right? 
soil, water, sunlight is a big garden. How fun. All right, so let's see if we can remember what they said helps the garden grow. Soil, soil starts with an S. Sunlight, remember we need light, light starts with an L. And what else did we need? That's right, water, W is what water starts with. Great job, everybody. So there's two worksheets you're gonna need today out of your packet. So your first one is, my garden grows, all right? So I want you to think about all the things that grow in a garden, and I want you to draw your garden, okay? It can look any way you want. It's your garden, so have fun with that, okay? The next one that you're gonna work on is plant parts. Yep, plant parts, i.e. at home. So you're gonna let help mom and dad will help you, but you're gonna draw the different parts of plants you eat. So let's think about it. So in a garden, there's lots of different plants and we eat all different parts of those plants, right? So we talked about pea pods, right, from our rhyming. So we eat that part of the plant. We eat strawberries, right? So we eat the fruit off of a plant. Carrots, carrots are a root plant, remember? They're part of the root family. And so we eat roots. So under the roots part of your paper, you can put carrots if you eat carrots. Sunflowers, we eat the seeds in the sunflower, don't we? So we can eat those or we can plant them and grow more sunflowers, right? So, and we also eat leaves. So let's go back to our mint bush. So this is our mint bush and these are leaves on a mint bush. Did you know you can eat those? You can eat them straight off the plant or you can make teas with them or put them in food. They're very delicious and they help settle your tummy. So go ahead and work on your plants that you eat either draw or try to write the words, whatever you want to do today, and then draw your garden. Remember, this is your garden. You have fun with it, okay? Well, I'll see you all next week. Have a great weekend, everybody.